Well, an invasive species right there has shown up at more Oklahoma lakes. These tiny creatures are known as zebra mussels. They've now been found in nearly 30 lakes, including Oklahoma City's Lake Hefner. So many of them, they look like gravel. Right. News 4's Lauren Daniels went there to explain how boaters can help keep zebra mussels out of the water. Zebra mussels are a familiar foe here in Oklahoma, and even though they are really small, they can cause some pretty big problems. Usually we'll find a, a public uh, water body or two every year, per, perhaps, that have a new infestation of zebra mussels. Don P. Brown with the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation says the list of infested lakes now stands at 27, including Lake Overholzer and here at Lake Hefner in Oklahoma City, where you can see them on the shoreline. Zebra mussels are small. They're the, when fully grown, they're about dime-sized mussels. And they have, uh, like their name implies, they have stripes on them. For water sources like Lake Hefner, they can lead to costly problems. They'll end up clogging up the uh, waterworks and the pipeways, and they have to be cleaned. There's no danger to the water supply itself as far as drinking water, but um, it just costs a lot more money to try to maintain everything after these mussels get into the uh, system. Brown says once zebra mussels make it to a lake, nothing can be done to eradicate them. But boaters can play a key role in controlling their spread. So whenever they go out on the water in their boat, we'd like them to make sure all the water is drained out of their boats, um, and they clean it with a power wash perhaps, and then dry that, let that boat dry out for hopefully, if they can, a week. And that should eliminate any type of transfer that we might get from uh, water, lake to lake with the, with the boats. Lauren Daniels, Oklahoma's News 4. Now, it can be very hard to see zebra mussel eggs, so that's why it's so important to clean your boat, even if none are visible.